In Green Bay, still looking for many answers tonight involving a testing scandal at a Green Bay Elementary School. It's a story we first told you about yesterday at 5. Now, the school district and state education officials are looking into allegations of violations at Eisenhower Elementary. Fox 11's Laura Smith has the latest on the investigation. Fox 11 caught up with Green Bay Superintendent Michelle Langenfeld at an education summit Wednesday. She would not talk with us about the investigation into the testing irregularities regarding the Wisconsin Knowledge and Concepts examination. Langenfeld sent a letter to the Department of Public Instruction last month stating an elementary school principal allowed teachers to preview standardized test items. The teachers then used some of the test questions and practice exams given to students in third, fourth, and fifth grade. District officials confirm Eisenhower Elementary is the school being investigated. They have not identified any of the staff members involved. Claudia Orr was Eisenhower's principal until a few weeks ago when she took a new position with the district. Orr won the Milken Award for Education Excellence in 2010. She received $25,000, which she says she used to pay for her children's education. District Community Relations Manager Amanda Brooker did not return our calls Wednesday. Instead, she said in an email, the district is unable to make a statement until the investigation on WKCE irregularities is closed. According to the DPI's website, test security protocols indicate test materials must be kept in locked storage. No one is allowed access to the test booklets prior to the first administration session. The only exception is for teachers who may have a student who requires special help to take tests. Anyone who has access to the test must sign a confidentiality agreement, and staff who do view the test are not allowed to copy or modify test questions. The DPI said in a statement Wednesday it is reviewing the information provided by Green Bay and it will follow up with the district. Agency spokesman Patrick Gaspar went on to say, there is no time frame established for completing a review of this nature as each one is unique. He continued, as such, we cannot discuss any specifics until the review has been completed. Fox 11 contacted the Green Bay Teachers Union for comment, but officials said they would not comment while the investigation continues. We also tried unsuccessfully to contact Orr and school board president Jean Marsh. As school let out for the day, Eisenhower parents we spoke with also declined to comment. In Green Bay, Laura Smith, Fox 11 News. And you can find more information about the DPI's testing security guidelines on our website, fox11online.com. Head to the News Link section, which is located at the bottom of our homepage.